Let's take a quick look at how we find specific tilt levels using uh, new generation access cameras. This is a feature introduced in um, current firmwares in the gyroscope enabled cameras. In this case, we're using an Axis Q1615. Um, so we can see at the top left of our video stream, we have tilt and rotation uh, figures displayed here. These are in degrees. So we'll see our tilt is 90, 91, floating between the two. Rotation is 179, sometimes dips to 178, like right there. Uh, so if we go ahead and tilt the camera, we'll see that this decreases. So right here, we're going to be at about 82, 83 degrees. Uh, we'll go further down. Right here, we're at about 74 or 75 degrees. So uh, the horizon is 90. Note that the horizon is not zero degrees, as some people are used to thinking of. Um, and then measuring down tilt in negative degrees, the horizon is uh, 90 degrees. So if we wanted to say have a 20 degree, degree down tilt, we need to subtract. Uh, so 90 minus 20, we'll want to take this down to 70 degrees. Let's just get that down here. So right about here, we're at 70 degrees. And we'll also see that if we rotate the uh, camera on its other axis, we will see the rotation uh, change in degrees. So it does work in both directions. We do have tilt and rotation. So in order to set this up, we look at our video stream settings. It's in our third section down here, which is simply overlay settings. And we want to include the text uh, pound OP and pound OR, all lowercase. Um, for uh, tilt and rotation, OP being tilt, rotation being OR. We've included tilt and rotation in a separator here just for clarity's sake, uh, make it easier to read instead of just having numbers, but uh, we really only need OP and OR.